welcome to my youtube channel online teaching today we will discuss about spss what is spss abbreviation of spss is statistical packages for social sciences key features of spss and uses of spss what is spss let us start spss is a software package used for statistical analysis, data management, and data visualization. It was originally developed by IBM in 1968 and has since become one of the most widely used tools in the field of social sciences, psychology, business, and various other disciplines that involve statistical analysis. Next. Key features of SPSS First, data management. SPSS allows users to import, clean, and manipulate data from various sources such as separate sheets, databases, and text files. It offers a user-friendly interface for data entry, editing, enabling researchers to organize and prepare their data for analysis. Next, data visualization. SPSS offers various tools for creating graphs, charts, and tables to visualize data. Researchers can generate histograms, bar charts, pie charts, and other geographical representations to better understand their data and communicate findings effectively. Next, Customization and extensions, SPSS allows users to extend its capabilities by creating custom procedures, functions, and macros. This flexibility enables researchers to tailor the software to their specific needs and research requirements. Next, Statistical analysis. SPSS provides a comprehensive set of statistical procedures for both basic and advanced data analysis. These include descriptive statistics, mean, median, standard deviation, etc., inferential statistics, t test, ANOVA, regression analysis, etc., factor analysis, cluster analysis, and more. SPSS extensive range of statistical tests makes it suitable for a wide variety of research projects and experimental design. Next, integration and data sharing. SPSS can work with various data formats and seamlessly integrates with other software applications like Microsoft, Excel, and databases. It facilitates data sharing and collaboration by allowing users to export and import data in the different formats. Next, syntax and programming. In addition to its geographical user interface application GUI, SPSS allows sports, a command syntax language. This allows users to perform complex analysis and repetitive tasks by writing scripts, making it easier to reproduce analysis and share them with others. Next, uses of SPSS. Academic research. Researchers in social sciences, psychology, economics, and other fields use SPSS to analyze data and draw conclusions from surveys and experiments. Second, healthcare and medical studies. SPSS helps analyze patient data, clinical trials, and medical research data to identify patterns, trends, and treatment outcomes. Next, third, business and finance. Companies use SPSS to conduct market analysis, evaluate financial data, and make data driven business decisions. Next, market research. SPSS is commonly employed in marketing to analyze consumer behavior, market trends, and customer preferences based on survey data. Next, 
government and policy analysis spss is used in government organizations to analyze data related to social policies demographics and public opinions summary in short spss is a powerful and user friendly statistical software it empowers researchers researchers and analysts to drive meaningful insights from data it is widely used in both academia and industry due to its reliability and ease of use however as technology advances alternative tools and programming languages like r and python have also gained popularity for statistical analysis especially in data science and machine learning domains Bien, Jazakallah for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so that you can get notification for upcoming videos.